Mm -mm. No, you don't. No, you won't. I'm not going to stand by her idly and watch you keep disrespecting yourself. I'm not going to stand for it. I can't understand for the life of me why you stand for it. Stop disrespecting yourself. Stop belittling yourself. Stop allowing others to belittle you and you think that they're right. You thinking, okay, you know what, you're right. Maybe I'm not worthy. Oh, you know what, you're right. Maybe I can't do it. Oh, maybe you're right. I wasn't born to be successful. You know, I'm just gonna stay in this little bitty hole and just let my existence play out. That's not you. That's not what you were, but that's what you've become. And this is the moment that it all stops. Because from me to you, if you don't hear nothing else I ever say, I want you to lock in and listen because you were put on this earth to win. You were born to win, not whine. You were born to get out of the dark and shine. You were born to fight through all the pressure and become the diamond that you are. You just stop believing it in your heart of hearts. Don't you get it? The odds of you even being born are something crazy like 400 trillion to one. But you made it. You arrived. You were born. And you were not put on this earth to lose. You were not put on this earth to be mediocre. You were not put on this earth to be average, below average. You were put here for a reason. You were put here for a purpose. You are put here to find a way to become the best version of yourself. And it all starts with you blocking out all the ignorance, blocking out all the madness, and finding a way to walk in your gift, finding a way to walk in your light, finding a way to understand the awesomeness of you and embracing the uniqueness that makes you you. Yeah, you are different. But guess what? We all are different and it's okay. I don't care what you look like. I don't care how you talk. I don't care how you act. I don't care how you dress. It's your God given right to do that. So I need you to be you and be okay with it. I need you to define what winning is to you and start putting together a plan of purpose. Start putting together a plan of action and start walking your way to being the excellent version of you, walking your way to winning in your game of life based on what you decide winning is. Whatever you write down on that piece of paper, this is what I'm trying to achieve. This is my goal. This is where I wanna go in my life. And never let no man, never let no woman, never let no doubter, no hater, no naysayer, stop you from becoming the best version of yourself. They are gonna be all up in your ear and you let that conversation, you let their words go right in one ear and right out the other and let it keep on moving. You hit them with a blah, get out of my face because this is my race and I promise you, whether I get there slowly or whether I get there fast, I am going to arrive. I'm going to embrace the process. I'm not gonna just trust the process. I'm going to enjoy the process. Because I know I am somebody. I know I was born to win. And guess what? From this day forward, I'm going to put one foot in front of the other. I ain't trying to take the elevator because that's the easy route. I'm taking the stairs. And I don't care what obstacle you put in front of me. You can put a brick wall in front of my face. And I'm going to run right through it. Because I got my mojo back. And it's my time to shine. I love this quote from the late, great Zig Ziglar. He says, you were born to win, but to be a winner, you must plan to win. You must prepare to win. And above all else, you must expect to win. And once you do that, you will find yourself climbing over that hump and making each and every day of your life a Wednesday. Victory is already yours, so claim it. This is a great day to win. Let's go.